What's up guys, I'm BTC, brand new patch today, the Lunar New Year event is here, so I'm going to go through and show you all the brand new cosmetics you can get. Let's check out all the new stuff. For the skins, we've got an epic for Brigida. I think this is on the upper end of quality for the epics. And we get to check out the weapons and stuff. The mace looks pretty much the same. The shield looks different. It's got spikes on the front. That's pretty cool. Next is Orisa. I think this is also a really cool looking epic. Some pretty nice details on it. And then the weapon as well. And then into the legendaries, we've got Hanzo with Huang Zong. I was making fun of the beard because it looks like it's kind of like a fake Santa beard. Look at it. Now that I can actually look at it in the hero gallery thing, like the beard isn't even like attached to his body. Like it's not falling on his body. It's just sticking straight out. The angry Santa beard. And the bow. Then we have Lubu. I think this is easily one of the best skins that they've ever added. And for this event, I think it's definitely the best. Something that I noticed is the feathers turn into the mist and stuff in the back. That looks really cool. That looks awesome. And then we also have the weapon, which also looks pretty cool. It's got that whole kind of uh, blunderbuss sort of thing looking. Guan Yu, another legendary Reinhardt, even though he had one in the past. That was two years ago, though, so quite a bit of time. The weapon for this looks really awesome as well. That looks really cool. Zhangfei, the Torbjorn, he's got kind of like this, uh, almost like a Goku Ryu sort of look going on. Looks pretty cool. He doesn't have uh, the hammer, it's just like a mace. So, we've got the rivet gun here. And the hammer, which is actually a mace with, well, the spikes right there, but those are not quite spikes. Still would hurt quite a bit, I'm sure. And then the turret. It actually looks like a cannon. Like if you look at the front part, it has a cannon on it. It also has kind of like that whole blunderbuss sort of thing looking, which is pretty cool. And then we have uh, Tracer. Again, they're going with the whole kind of flintlock style sort of deal. I really like that. I think that stuff is really cool. And then we also have Zenyatta, who again got another legendary. The skin looks pretty cool. I originally thought those were supposed to be like ram's horns or something, but it's not. It's just a hat. And then the orbs themselves as well. So we're going to check out the emotes. Uh, it turns out they both are emotes. So she throws them up in the air. I, I was told that this is a, a game of some sort. Man, what's with the Ana emotes where she just throws stuff on the ground? And then we also have Soldier. And then we have uh, the victory poses. So there's the firework theme with the victory poses for the Lunar New Year event. So we've got Ash. We've got... Doomfist. He's got a whole bunch of them. And then Hanzo. Oh, that's kind of neat. It's not actually fireworks. It's him drumming. That's cool. And then Stockpile. I think this is like the same pile of stuff that McCree uses as him in his uh, highlight intro. The Armament. Lots of fireworks. And then we got the voice lines. No one likes a squealer. Ready for the fireworks to begin. Ultimately, my aunt Gould. Who's ready to party? Pointless frivolity. That's gonna get spammed. Happy New Year! How's that for some fireworks? To the moon and back. <laughs> Assessing luck, medium fortune. <laughs> Engaging festive mode. Oh, plays music. It has like a little music box. Now, I think this is a, a one that has random stuff. Assessing luck, small fortune. <laughs> Assessing luck, financial outlook strong. 
yeah, so it does have a whole bunch of them. So that's kind of like the Arissa one, where she calculates something or other, and it gives a different one each time. So that's kind of cool. I like that, because it actually has different audio for every single time you play it. And then we have sprays. So all of these characters need to get the, the dragon sprays here. So we've got Ash. Both of hers. We've got Brigitte's Dragon Dance. We've got a Feast. We've got Hammond. And also the Snacks. And then for the... Well, we'll get to that in a second. So we also have a highlight intro, which is... That's pretty cool. It also kind of goes right along with his victory pose as well. All right, so I want to show you something here. There are two achievements. There's one for uh, uh, this one right here, which is captured achievement, and then interrupted delivery, where unlocked by completing the... Now, as you can see, they are locked, and I cannot use them, all right? Now, if I go to my hero gallery, and I just pick any character, and I go to sprays, and I scroll down, both of those achievements are locked, okay? So it's it's locked, I can't use it. However, if I go to my career profile and my achievements, you'll notice that I've completed this one. And that's because it was put into the game with the last patch. And you can even see it, recent achievements, delivery interruption. So I've completed this achievement and I'm supposed to have the spray for it, but I don't. Now, I don't know how big of a bug this is going to be. Maybe if I play a Capture the Flag match, and then, you know, I do this achievement again, maybe it will give it to me, maybe it won't. So this might be a bug that Blizzard needs to hotfix, but I don't know. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open a loot box. So I have a whole bunch of loot boxes from, from uh, the winter and from the normal, but we're just gonna open the Lunar New Year event one and see what I get. Ooh, nice. So we got two voice lines and the Orissa skin. Not too bad. So that is all of the new cosmetics. And in addition to this, there's also been a bunch of the balance changes that have been put into the game with this patch as well. And I have another video that's gonna be going over that and what the impact is. So what is your favorite skin from this entire event? Let me know down below. Thanks for watching, and if you'd like to see more, subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss anything. Also, come hang out in my Discord server and my Twitch live stream. Special thanks to my Patreon supporters. If you'd like to see what kind of cool VIP rewards you can get, check the links down below. And remember, always, always blame the controller, because it's never your fault.